We've got the Rays, and starting things off, they're going to jump out to a 3-0 lead because Rene Pinto, their nine-hitting catcher, is going to hit a two-run homer. It's just amazing. I feel like every year we say it over and over again that the Rays just find ways to win, and this year, whether it's losing Shane McClanahan or Wander Franco, they just continue to win without them, and it just makes you believe that there's really not going to be a year where they're going to be terrible because even with as much injuries as a pitching rotation can have, losing the young superstar in Wander Franco, they continue to find ways to win just something about this organization they just do it right but anyways Tristan Casas now in the top of the seventh he's gonna hit a ball way up high but it's somehow gonna drop for a game time single Tristan Casas obviously that's not any pop or line drive hit but he's been incredible this year he's probably not gonna win rookie of the year but he's definitely gonna get some votes some second place third place votes at least now we're in the bottom of the 10th 5-5 Red Sox they need these wins to hold on to any wild the card hopes but then Adam Duvall he's gonna catch it. he's gonna throw it up the line Connor Wong gets it on the hop and puts the tag on Josh Lowe so at that point that was definitely a big play for the Red Sox and then another little blooper this one to go ahead Brandon Lau he's probably a little frustrated he was bobbling with it obviously that's not an error because that's not a routine play but he probably thought that maybe he had a shot to catch that but it doesn't matter because Lau he's gonna come up in the bottom of the 11th against Kenley Jansen and an absolutely laser that just tucks fair into the foul pole as Brandon Lau is hitting the walk-off three-run homer and as far as the Red Sox they're five games back in the wild card hunt four and a half depending on who loses so these are big games for them too but then the Rays they just find ways to win it's always the guys that you never expect Brandon Lau he's been there for a bit he's had a little bit of a down year but now a walk-off three-run homer is big time his 18th homer of the year the Rays they're two and a half behind the O's we'll see if they can make a chance in the AL East.